It's the first time in a year that 14 year old Walker Johnson. Uh, it's an emotional day. Is back on the pitcher's mound. I'm trying to not have my mind on, oh, you're going to get hit again or, oh, you're going to get hurt up there. I just I want to have a good day and um, see what I can do on the mound. The last time the Spring Forest Middle School student took the field, his life almost ended. I waited for this day, you know, since the day of the accident. He said, I want to get back out there. I want to get back out there and he couldn't. Walker was hit in the chest by a speeding line drive, stopping his heart. It took me a couple seconds to regain my breath and then I fell to the ground and not remembering what happened and I woke up in the ambulance. After a week in the hospital and a year without physical activity, he's back, but this time wearing what's called a heart chest protector. It's kind of like a bulletproof vest, honestly, like it stops balls like a bulletproof vest stops bullets. That's just how the inventor describes it. And there's now an effective protection against sudden death on the sports fields. Robert Vito is the CEO of Unequal Technologies. We're taking military grade protection, stuff that you use to stop bullets, high speed projectiles, and morphing it into that sports protection. Already being used by some players in the major leagues and even the NFL, it's giving Walker and his parents the confidence and comfort to know he's safe. It's something that you have to overcome and something that you have to power through. I'm very comfortable with him wearing it. He wouldn't be out here if he wasn't wearing it.